Hi guys, it's Tribe Simmer here and welcome back to my Castaway Challenge. Um, I just want to say thank you for coming back. Um, I've been playing a little bit off screen while I've been away, while I've not been posting videos. Um, so, you know, they've been getting on alright. Um, they've been looking after themselves, been feeding themselves, they've been catching food, they've been gardening, they've been looking out for each other. Generally, just making a bit of money for the for the tribe, um, and just being all right. Apart from one sim, and now that sim is being lazy. They've been sitting around. They've not been really doing anything, and they've been expecting everybody else to do everything for them. Now, my sims aren't that great at sharing, to be honest, and um, so they haven't been able. To, this particular sim hasn't had anything to eat and is very very close to dying of starvation now i'm not gonna let on who that is yet but i'm gonna tell you it's gonna happen very very soon um the rest of the clan seem to be getting on all right and this is going the opposite way to what i'm meant to be going that's that's bonkers they're a little bit uncomfortable at the moment but that's because I got rid of the campfire for a bit. Um, what I've decided though, to make things a little bit more interesting, a little bit more fun for me to play and for you to watch, I'm going to let them have some more amenities. So I'm not going to expect them to catch everything that they eat. You know, if there's stuff around, they can catch, they can have veggie burgers and stuff like that. So every now and again, I'm going to get the fire out, let them eat whatever they fancy, but then bring the fire back. Um, I've also saved up and bought them a bath because when they were uncomfortable because of the smell um, they weren't really doing anything like, literally they wouldn't feed themselves because they were smelly I, I don't understand that like really just because you smell doesn't mean that you can't catch some food like where is the logic in that I do not know um, so I'm just gonna get on with playing. Um, we have another cow plant planted over there, so we're gonna have a few pets on the earth. Well, I say pets. Are there pets? I don't. We don't have pets yet, so I suppose it's the closest thing you've got to having a pet. Yeah, it's not like The Sims One. Do you remember from the first one where you had that like? guinea pig or a hamster was it a guinea pig? I think it was a guinea pig you got in a cage I used to love that like I'm not a massive pet person in the slightest and I'm not that bothered about having the pets games but I used to love having that it was I mean I, I killed I always forgot to feed them and the amounts of hamster guinea pig things please correct I have no idea what it is I'm gonna have to google this later on um, but the amount of creatures that I had that I would forget about and then and then I would kill them off and make my simmies sad I mean this is before they could get sad but I would still make them sad she just walked on water to go to the toilet I don't get why they don't just pee in the pool like we've all done it right um so yeah we are currently just waiting to see what is going to happen um they're all sleeping at the minute i think i'm going to save up and get them some mat you know the air mattress beds that you can get and um, because they don't sleep too well um on these on when they're napping all the time like it's fine for a bit but i think that they're not getting enough sleep so they get in bad mood too quick and they don't do anything um what she just stood there for? Now she's just walking through. I love how glitchy this game is. Like, seriously. Oh! He's fell asleep in the bath and she's got embarrassed because she saw him in the bath. I suppose he's in the nude. What can you do? How about you come and play with the bubbles that somebody had in their pocket? Surely you can do that. Blow bubbles. You're the only person that seems to be awake. Oh, I Sophie, actually. Aw, oh, they're all in a bad mood. 
Oh, she had a dirty bath, so she's dirtier than she was before. Lovely. Oh no! Here we go. Elena is dying from starving. Oh, we missed it. Oh no! There it is, guys. Elena. It was Elena. She didn't do anything. She didn't contribute. I'm sorry, but you you didn't look after yourself, sweetheart. And and now you've died. And now all the Sims are going to be sad. But look at Sophie, she's witnessing it. Poor Sophie, haven't witnessed this. Aww. Grim's coming. I can hear Grim, but I can't see him. Aww. No, I don't witness the death. Don't come in. No! Oh, they're all coming over. Oh no! Oh, and this tree's in the way, so I can't get a good shot. Get that on your tablet, Grim. Oh. No. There we go, guys. Elena's died. Or dying. Because she didn't eat anything. I think ch ch that someone just peed on Grim. <laughs> Was that Clifford? <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't be laughing, like, this is not the time or place to laugh, but... Yeah, Clifford just peed on the Grim Reaper. Oh, you're next, mate. You are next. You just peed on the Grim Reaper. He is going to be waiting for you. Then you just walk through your pee over the body. <gasps> this is taking a long time. Come on. Get your scythe. Is it a scythe? I think it's... A... Whenever I'm recording, I forget words and I just can't words anymore like the rest of the time I have no problem with saying words and knowing things I love this music yes and no oh there we go seven six have become seven <gasps> guys now oh, I'm gonna just save this for now because my game has been really glitchy so I'm going to save this and I'll be back with you in a couple of minutes right there we go we are saved so everyone's in a bad mood Grim's still here and they're all getting a little bit peckish themselves now we don't want any more deaths so I'm going to get the campfire back and I'm going to let them eat some stuff off the campfire because we can't have them all starving, surely. Well, I think I'm going to pop the campfire back where it was before. I liked it in that corner. Didn't start too many fires. Started too many fires. I'm going to move you out of the way, though. Um, I'm going to sell you. Because these plants that I put in don't seem to be, like, having anything harvestable so I think what I'm going to do is get rid of them as I go along and have the, what's this plumbing upgrade part I don't need that they don't have plumbing oh look we're making some manners so I think what the next thing I'm going to save up for is the artist diesel because then we can earn some more money and buy them some beds and get things going a little bit more I guess I don't just want it to be about survival, like I say, it's not that interesting for you to watch me prattling about. Um, let me see how much that actually is. I don't think it's too expensive, the artist's easel. But who knows, right? 350 That's more expensive than I anticipated. But we did save up for the campfire, so I'm sure we can manage somehow. Right, who's awake? Mika, you're our cook. You can... Don't put it in. Light it. Light it. And put a log on and then people will just come around and eat. And then it'll all be good. Because you need to get out your bad moods because somebody died. Hopefully now somebody's died. It'll be a little bit less glitchy because there's less sims. Oh, you know, when I created this challenge, I was like, oh, you know what? Elena's going to be great, she's cool, I've made her all like, she's got practical hair and she's wearing shorts. Nah, nah. 
not in the slightest I would never in a blue moon have thought that she would be the first to go but she is and it's sort of sad but it's just what's happened so there we go there we go I've got a bit more money earning um have we seen any more dead trees I can sell this is kind of defeating the object but you know they're dying and we can't do anything about it now that'll do we've made a bit of money I'll get them doing some more practical things recently right oh hang on he's burnt oh no he's burnt himself oh my goodness he can't have two deaths in one go on Mika you put another log in oh, I forgot they can actually like this might be the next death death by fire they can like play with it and stuff can't they don't even have an emotion potion will that oh there we go will this get rid of his sadness thing you know what oh you're sad there we go witness death but he's just got so much else going on he, that's just not well never mind no you're not going to drink your emotion potion that's fine um, what can we do what can we do? I can't wait till our cow plants are alive and we have some pets. Sophie, you need something to do. Right. I'm just pleased we've had our first death now. Like, it's out of the way. I'm a bit sad it was Lena. Like, she was the one I thought was going to be really attached to. But it's actually turned out that Sophie's by become one of my favourite because she's just adorable like I made her high maintenance and I made her like lazy because I, I you need that sim who's rubbish don't you like I kind of did that on purpose but the thing is because she's lazy she enjoys going around like napping and stuff so whenever she wakes up from a nap which is all she can do she's happy and because we're living on this massive lot and although it, hey look Grim's coming to sit around the fire and although like um there's not much there the lot is quite worth quite a lot so she's quite happy the grim reaper is inspired but i suppose reaping's probably quite an expiring expiring inspiring thing see what i mean about not being able to talk properly um but yeah and she's on this lot that's like expensive even though it's literally an island but it makes her happy so she's always got a little bit of chill about her you know what I'm gonna do so so there's a bath you can use it they're just choosing not to right is a toilet broke again no it's just dirty why aren't they using it clean Oh, bye Grim. And you know what? On that note. Hang on. Let me just check. Oh, he didn't like the potion. What's wrong with the potion? Oh, gross scoop. Um, you know what? On that note, I'm going to call it. Um, the next time I see you, I'm going to get them to do some activities and stuff. Maybe make them a bit more money off screen. But that is it for now. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I do appreciate that you're actually sitting here listening to me blab on for 20 minutes of your life. Um, I do appreciate that. If you have any ideas of who you think might die next, who you think might be the last to survive, who you think you want to die because you know we can we can do that if that's something you want to do we can get that situation happening it's up to you guys um but yeah so if you enjoyed this video please 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 give me a like a big thumbs up and if you enjoy the series if you enjoy my channel please subscribe and uh, thank you so much for watching um, and i'll see you when i see you bye guys